A mother said that uh, what is wajib for a woman uh, in front of her non-mahram is to only cover the head uh, and your body to and including the ankles. And it's fine if you're wearing jeans or trousers. A mother said that it was wajib for a woman in front of her non-mahram. Non-mahram, uh, wait, in front of her non-mahram? What? In front of a mahram or non-mahram? In front of her mahram men, yes. In front of non-mahram men, no. What do you mean? Then what is the hijab and the jilbab? What is the, what is the purpose of, of covering yourself if you're just going to sh show them everything? As long as your skin is covered? Oh, how to do da'wah to her? Wallah, she needs to learn Islam from scratch. She obviously does not understand the objective of hijab. She does not understand the objective of covering yourself. She does not know. A lot of people have a misconception. Really, a lot of Muslims think hijab is that you cover your hair. Sisters walk around with their head covered, wearing tights that show their complete figure. And I can promise you, and I can even make a, an oath by Allah, that 99.99% .99 of men could care less about your hair. You could be bald. You could be a straight up bald sister with a skinhead and have what they call a body and a man is going to be like, no problem. May Allah grant her hair. I will still, you know, I have no problem with looking and inspecting and checking out and appreciating her figure, her bottle-like body shape. Unless you don't know men. So for sisters to be discovered in their hair, that's because of a cultural misunderstanding of what hijab is. They think that the, uh, uh, what, what is it called? The, hijab, the head cover, the scarf. They think that the head scarf is what hijab is. La wallah, la wallah, that's not what the hijab is. The hijab is that a man sees nothing of you that makes him want you. Anything that you show that makes a man want you, and believe me, men want a lot, then you're not wearing proper hijab. If you're wearing tight pants, if you're wearing something that shows your uh, uh, family, it shows your family, that shows your, your, your figure. If you're wearing something that shows, يعني, that make uh, colorful, too colorful, too attractive, too much adornment, all of this, all of this is going to be like for a man, all right, I like. Hair covered, hair uncovered is irrelevant. It completely irrelevant to the discussion. So that's what you need to explain to her. Man, what kind of misconceptions do we have, people? Come on. Come on, man. Yeah. Man, and every man knows what I'm talking about. And you know what's funny? Even the sisters know what I'm talking about. Even the sisters deep down, they know what's up. They know what's up. But yani, we, we all let the shaitan play, you know, play a game and get the, get the best, uh, you know, what is the term? Get the best of us or something. We just let the shaitan have a field day with us. In reality, every woman knows, every man knows what's up. The sister knows what she's wearing and she knows what the man is going to check out and what he's going to appreciate. And 90% of them do it pur purposely. She purposely puts on some, you know, uh, cute stuff. Even though she's telling herself that she's covered, she knows deep down that she's going to be checked out. And that's one of her purposes and objectives. To be appreciated, to be, you know, to, for the people to say good stuff about her. Come on now, cut the crap, guys. Come on, man. Hey. Thanks for watching this video. Subscribe and click on the notification bell. Like, comment, and share with friends and family.